Investigators say a Canadian Pacific freight train was parked and began to move on its own before it derailed and killed three crew members near the Alberta-British Columbia boundary on Monday. The Transportation Safety Board said Tuesday the westbound 112 car train had been parked on a grade for two hours near Field, BC about 80 km west of Banff along the Trans-Canada Highway, when it started rolling. It barreled along for just over 3 km before 99 cars and two locomotives derailed at a curve ahead of a bridge, the TSB said. Only 13 cars and the tail-end locomotive remained on the tracks. The lead locomotive came to rest on its side in a creek and a number of derailed cars came to rest on an embankment, said TSB senior investigator James Carmichael as he provided an update on the investigation in Calgary on Tuesday. The remaining cars, including the mid-train remote locomotive, piled up behind. On Monday, Greg Edwards, with the Teamsters Canada Rail Conference, said the train fell more than 60 meters. The crash killed conductor Dylan Paradis, engineer Andrew Dockrell and trainee Daniel waldenberg Bulmer, all based out of Calgary. At this point, we're calling it a loss of control, which is when the crew can no longer maintain the track speed, said Carmichael. Carmichael said a new crew had just boarded and was preparing to take over control of the train, which had been parked with its emergency air brakes activated. It was not anything the crew did. The train started to move on its own, he said. We're going to try to determine why the brakes didn't stay in place. The TSB said the train gained speed well in excess of the 32 km per hour maximum for the tight turns in the mountain pass in the moments leading up to the derailment, which happened at mile 130.6 of the Lagan subdivision between the upper and the lower spiral tunnel, near Field, BC. Christopher Monette, TCRC's Director of Public Affairs, had described it as a runaway train. At Tuesday's briefing Carmichael, of the TSB, used the phrase loss of control. He said it was too early in the investigation to 